Yo, what's up, guys? Today we're gonna to be talking about my rituals, right? I've just, I've just finished my read, my rituals. So this is the droid right here after my rituals. So I'm gonna just kind of try and explain to you guys how I did it. Why did first I, you know, uh, separated my hair into three parts, right? This side was one part, the uh, the other side one part, and then the back side one part. So I did took three days to do them, right? This side I did this side on Saturdays, and then this side I did on on Sundays. Back side I did on Mondays. So yesterday Monday was the last day of me retuching, finish retuching my hair using what using the crochet hook. Mr. Crochet Hook. I always want to make sure when I retuse my dreads, they last for four months. Four months before I retuse again, right? Because I want to give more time to my hair to rise a little bit and then grow, you know, easily, comfortably. Because if you're always putting pressure onto your hair, so they'll be like a fragile. When they, your hair are fragile, and then they, they, they start, you know, breaking. So if you start breaking your hair, means that you're gonna start losing your hair, right? You don't want to lose your hair because the more longer your hair, uh, it means that the more your hair is gonna look good, right? Just like mine, right? Looked up though, looked up after my retuse. If you if you wanna follow my step, this how how I did mine. Grow your hair first seven months, eight months after after that start and use the crochet hook and then hook your hairs right do not use locking gel use the crochet hook right because if you use the crochet hook your hair is going to be clean most of the time right your hair scarf is going to be clean if you have to reduce as you can see my hair scarf is pretty clean right it's pretty clean so use the crochet hook your hair is going to lock very fast super duper fast compared to locking gel because locking gel you're not going to be able to wash your hair most of the time but crochet hook you can wash your hair and the more you wash your hair the more you open out your pores and the more your hair can grow very fast and in this way your hair is locking up very fast and your hair is growing very fast so you got one stone for two birds right your hair is growing very fast and your hair is locking up very fast right and trust me the more you wash your hair the more your hair your hair is going to be rough and they, when they hook up they're going to stay they're not going to undo right they're going to be able to tangle to tangle with each other and then they can they can lock up very fast right so but if you cannot use the locking gel and then you know washing your hair your hair look a little bit greasy they kind of like a look like a little bit flipping they're flipping up over each one right so they're not going to lock that very fast so the only way for you to make them lock very fast wash your hair use the crochet so that's one of the quickest secret i'm going to give you to you guys right as my dry, you can see my dry, they're pretty clean, right? As you can see, that's how I'm born, and my hair start growing from here. Not here, but here. So, for someone who doesn't know, they might be thinking my forehead is receding, right? But actually, it is not receding. That's how my hair is, right? 